teaching environments here, there's a great sort of there's a variation of teaching methods and different uh, sort of teaching environments. We do have the big lecture halls, uh, we do have um, seminar groups and workshops um, and one-to-one -one sessions. I really enjoy the uh, interaction that we have. It's not just sat down, them talking to you and you having to write notes. You've got an opinion, your voice matters, your voice counts. So lecturers take that into perspective as well. We really believe that students need to take control of their own learning and, and that we are there to facilitate and support them to learn as much as they can and to really explore things and to be challenged. Well traditionally people think that at university you're just going to have an essay based sort of um, assessment but here we have a great range of different assessment methods. What we're trying to do is do exciting things like eat portfolios or work related case studies that relate to the real world. Some students might really shine when they're able to explain concepts orally and use their own words to explain ideas. Other students might be really strong in their writing skills, others might like to present things visually. And it's that, that, that range of, of different assessment and learning styles that is uh, obviously always enhances you as, a, as an individual and a, and a learner. At this university we also focus on um, developing kind of analytical skills, self-reflection. If they can act professionally and learn how to act professionally during their degrees, they then will become good professionals in the workplace after they've graduated. I want to kind of uh, build myself as a person, so my academic writing, my even ability to communicate across effectively, and I think it has done that. So trying to stimulate and motivate students to, to really showcase what they can do, to reach their academic potential.